Hey everyone, it's Lillian and I have a quick recipe for you for microwaved potato chips. All you need is either a just a regular dinner plate that you can put in the microwave lined with parchment paper or you can use a bacon tray for um, for the microwave. You need Yukon Gold potatoes. Uh, these are actually called butter buds and they, I got these from um, Kroger's and a very sharp knife to slice them thinly or as I have here a mandolin so let's get started okay with the mandolin I'm just going to slice until I get down close to the blade you don't want to get to the blade and then whack fingers off but anyways just go back and forth with the mandolin alright and as you can see these are very very thin so what we're going to do now and I will finish the rest here in just a minute off camera but what you want to do is you just want to lay them on the tray and you know just line them and once all the tray has, has been lined or your parchment lined um, plate you put them in the microwave at high power which is in your normal setting for three and a half minutes and then you'll take them out you'll flip them over and do them another three and a half to four minutes um, but be you know mindful of it because they can scorch and burn on you um, and when you take them out some of them may be feel like a, they may be a little chewy you know if you try them but when you sit them out in the air they crisp up even more so when they're done what I'll do is just sprinkle them lightly with either garlic powder or a little bit of sea salt and when they're done I'll show you what they look like okay this is after the first three and a half minutes you can probably see they're they're steaming I don't know if you can see that or not um, but if I hold one up try not to burn myself you can see they're a little bit dry on one side. What I'm going to do now is just flip them all over and put them back in the uh, microwave for about four minutes. So I'll see you when they're done. Yummy, yummy. Okay, this is how they turned out. I don't want to burn myself, so I'm just going to bring them to the camera. You see how they turned out? They look just like potato chips. Um, I had to really watch these because you see how in the middle they're a little bit brown. Well, I feel like that gives it character. So, uh, what I'm going to do is put these on my little plate here, put a little salt on them while they're still warm, and uh, let them sit at room temperature for a couple minutes. And then when I come back, you're going to hear the crunch. Oh, yeah. Okay, this have been, has been sitting for not even a minute. Um, and I'm going to let you hear the crunch of this potato chip. Mm-hmm. Alright, so Weight Watchers, these are three points plus. And if you're on Simply Filling, they are a, a uh, power food. So this is a really, really good snack for... If you love potato chips and you know you're going to eat the entire bag if you go buy one, get you some Yukon Gold potatoes, slice them up thin, and follow this recipe. You will not be disappointed. And the flavor varieties, I mean, gosh, you can put cumin on them, you can put chili powder, you know, whatever you want on them and make them your own. They're way healthier than what you're going to buy in a bag. And... This video is especially for Felicia in Nurse because Lori asked me to do a video on it. I did find this recipe on Facebook um, and I will put the recipe below. So I will talk to you guys later. I hope you like these and until next time, take care.